Devotions. With Bishop Barra Fonseca. Justice needs to be served in your life. Because our God is a righteous God. Never blame God for the injustice, humiliation, shame in your life. You have to be revolted against all sorts of injustice. Because they are not from God. They are not from God. Jesus said if a son asks a piece of bread, no father will give a stone. If the human being, if the human being, the human father, mother, will not give a stone to his son, imagine God. How can you blame God? How can you say that God is punishing you? No, he is not. The human being, the human justice fail, but the divine justice never ever fail. There was a woman, a widow, she came to the unjust judge. Let us read the scripture for a better understanding. Now there was a widow in that city, and she came uh, to see him, to see the judge. And she was asking for justice. She said, get me justice. Justice for me from my adversary. And you have many adversaries, many enemies in your life. Then the Lord God said, hear what the unjust judge said. Shall not God avenge his own elect who cry out day and night to him? Because that judge... He did not want to serve justice, but because she pleaded, she insisted, she persevered. One day he said, I'm going to grant justice. Jesus said, if the unfair judge, unjust one, grant justice for her, will not God avenge his own elect, his chosen one, his children? He's going to give you the bread of justice. On September... Fifteenth, at every universal church, we are raising a cry out. We are raising our voice to cry for the divine justice. You will go to one of our churches on the altar. You are going to present your cases. The Lord will hear you. He's going to listen to you and grant you justice. Now, I'm talking to you. You serve the God of justice yet live in injustice. You serve the Lord who heals, yet you are sick. You serve a prosperous God, yet you are in misery. Now, I ask you, is that fair? And shall God not avenge his own, elect who cry out day and night to him, though he bears along with them? Of course he will, if you do your part. That's why the pastors from all over the USA will pray for you day and night for divine justice in your life. Take part in this campaign on September 15th, the great day of divine justice. The human justice has failed, but the divine justice never fails.